It said, American heritage never sleeps, from before sunrise to sundown and beyond. There is always something going on at American Heritage Schools. Children are involved, parents are involved, faculty are dedicated and involved, and your child will truly find their passion here at our incredible schools. The thing that makes American Heritage so special is that each student is treated as a unique individual. I think the difference here at American Heritage is that all students are held to a very high standard. I definitely feel very proud when people ask me, oh, like, what school do you go to? And I have like, the privilege to say American Heritage. The academic experience here at Heritage was, was very good. I never felt like I was behind when I got to Harvard. My oldest graduated last spring. He's currently a first year student at Yale. He says the workload is not overwhelming. He knows how to present himself in class, how to interact one-on-one -on -one with the faculty. American Heritage, when it says it's a college preparatory school, it means it. I feel incredibly excited every day to come to school and that has been a sentiment that has been with me since kindergarten. Since I've been at American Heritage, I have definitely grown so much as a person. I've become more confident and able to explore things that I thought I would never be good at that. And now I think, why not? I think one thing that sets American Heritage apart from other schools is that you get the perfect amount of guidance and independence at the same time. So you're always on the straight path, but you also have to pace yourself. At Heritage, you aren't like limited to just one mindset. You get to see other people who are interested in other things. So I can open my mind and contribute to the school and to my community. The campus at American Heritage is so beautiful and the environment definitely contributed to my success as a student. I think being surrounded by beauty constantly um, and just being in an uplifting and positive environment encourages you to be the best person that you can be. We have two beautiful 40-acre campuses, one located in Plantation, Florida, and one 30 minutes north in Delray Beach. Both are in safe, wonderful neighborhoods. We have university-level science research facilities, an electron microscope for our science research students, and an outdoor environmental learning center for our elementary students. We have full courtrooms where students learn from lawyers and judges, 3D printers which are incorporated into the curriculum, and a state-of-the-art 800-seat proscenium theater, tennis courts, fields to run and play, gymnasiums, and swimming pools. I love giving campus tours. The best part is when a parent says, I wish I could go back to school as a student at American Heritage. I founded American Heritage School in 1971. There was a lot of turmoil in the, in the United States, and so we said, what would be a good word to talk about uh, education and the history of education? So we thought of heritage. We have a great deal of diversity, which is part of the American culture. It really does uh, reflect uh, what we are today. One of the wonderful things about American Heritage Schools, we're a complete school. We go from pre-kindergarten all the way through 12th grade. So all of our teachers are always talking curriculum and there's not ups and downs in the curriculum, but it's a smooth transition from grade to grade. For children to become lifelong learners, they need to retain that excitement that they have, that thrill of learning something new. That starts in PK3. They're also learning a lot of the basic courtesies that go along with being just a person in general. Children not only have to develop their ability to learn, but they have to develop their perseverance. So we're looking more to develop the entire child and all of the skills necessary to be successful. We have a wonderful character development program where we educate students beginning in pre-K-3 on our core values of knowledge, integrity, and compassion. Because we want our students to grow up at American Heritage embodying these pillars of community and good citizenship and friendship. In elementary, American Heritage develops the whole child, a well-rounded child. Starting in PK3, children will be exposed weekly to separate instructors in visual arts, music, science lab, environmental education, foreign language, physical education, computers, and media. When students enter upper elementary, the elective choices expand into band, orchestra, drawing, painting, ceramics, drama, and choir. These experiences are so important for enhancing imagination, creativity, and college preparation. We make sure our elementary students are challenged but not discouraged. 
For many of the core academic classes, there are different levels of instruction. For example, in fourth grade math, there may be four different levels, including our top aims program, which uses a curriculum from Stanford University and it's designed to challenge students at the 98 and 99 percentiles in elementary math. It's college prep at its finest. As technology is always moving forward, we are too as well. And so we need to make sure that we teach our students digital literacy so they find the correct information. Our curriculum is extensive. We have courses in all the core disciplines at the college prep, honors, and AP levels in science, math, computer science, English, foreign language, architecture, journalism, broadcast, creative writing. I mean, you name it and you can study it here. Our pre-professional programs were started over 20 years ago and the inspiration for the program was to create a unique curriculum only taught by doctors, lawyers, engineers, and leaders in business. So they go into college more focused and better prepared. So the students get a very comprehensive view of not just science and medicine, they become critical thinkers. It's amazing to see the actual heart itself and you get to really translate your anatomy knowledge to seeing an actual patient. I got so many more opportunities than I had previously thought I would. Like not just in the program, whereas we would get to talk to doctors every single day. We're taught by them in our classes. I was able to take something that's like very personal and important to me, like type 1 diabetes. Being able to pursue it in the lab has been like one of the best things ever. I did always have an interest in law, but when I came to American Heritage, I really really knew that this is what I wanted to do. But then we also take it to the next level and that's when we participate in mock trial or moot court and we're actually applying this law and acting as real attorneys. My dream is to be a software engineer at a great software company, maybe even start my own in the future and try to make the world better through algorithmic thinking. The people here are really, they're incredible, they're amazing, so talented. It, it really provides the opportunity to push yourself because you see everyone else doing so great you want to do uh, just as well as everyone else and it pushes you to be the best person that you can be. We have many of our AP and honors and salutatorians and valedictorians in this building because they feel the passion for the arts is an important part of their education and studies have shown that these people who are left brain right brain really need both to succeed. I step into another world when I enter this classroom. There's so many amazing artists that came here and you see their work and you're like I want to be that. We have ceramics and sculpture. We have one teacher that's dedicated specifically to photography, architecture, and then the graphic design programs of the art world. Then on the other side, we have a full complement of what we consider performing arts, theater and band and orchestra and chorus, piano, guitar, all the technical aspects of the theater, makeup, stagecraft, stage design, lighting. Our productions are entirely crewed by students. The adults don't do anything. Once the curtain rises, we're hands off. We can only get so far in theory in the classroom, and so we have to actually do theater for them to learn theater. The choir is sung at Carnegie Hall. The band has taken trips all over the country, and we continue to push the envelope to find things that they can participate in to strengthen them, but to, to expand them as well so that they can really reach their potential. You're working with directors who have directed famous actors, worked with famous actors. It is, it is the real deal. And they give you as close to a college or real world experience as possible. American Heritage offers 19 different sports, which is an incredible thing for our student athletes to be able to join into something that they may or may not know they'll love. American Heritage has a no-cut policy for their athletics, which means that everyone can belong to the, the sport, the team that they're interested in, and we love that. We want everybody to join in and be part of that athletic family, and it gives everybody the opportunity to compete to play. To be a two-time state champion since I've started, it's just like unreal. Being a part of that has really made me grow as a person and made me realize the opportunities that I have gotten since I've been at Heritage. Several of our coaches, they're former professional athletes, they've been in the Olympics. I have tremendous respect for our coaching staff because they don't just work on their sport, they work on the, the development of the full child, of leadership and character and showing them how important it is to be bigger than just the sport. 
This program has not only allowed me to participate in the highest athletic levels I thought possible, but it's also allowed me to participate in the highest academic levels as well in the classroom. Not only is it diverse of culture, but it's diverse of thought. So we have different clubs to uh, supplement that. We have political club, the ACT club, whatever fits you. And I think that's a really great opportunity that we have at American Heritage to find a community that fits us best or even explore new communities that we didn't even know that we enjoyed. Our goal is college preparation and we don't want test scores to interfere with a student's dreams. We want to bring them to their highest heights so they can reach their dreams and go to the school of their choice. We do slow and steady preparation for the SAT and ACT starting in ninth grade. It's built into our curriculum. Workbooks and videos and instructional lessons on uh, how to approach the problems. And moving forward, uh, we actually started to use an application and those three things combined made facing the SAT and ACT and other standardized tests much easier than I think it would have been otherwise. Our motto here is that college is a match to be made, not a prize to be won. And we really believe it. We are very fortunate here that we get to travel to a lot of colleges and that colleges come here so we get to know them. But we also really get to know our students. And the guidance office was awesome in helping me through those applications and ultimately getting me what I thought was nearly impossible, which was helping me get into Harvard. Next year I will be attending Yale University. In the fall, I will be attending Emory University. Princeton University. Princeton University. Cornell University. Columbia University. Heritage has prepared me for college by allowing me the opportunity and the time to experience what it feels like to balance both a really rigorous academic course load and also allow me to take intense courses that will be similar to those at Yale. Berkeley seemed like a great continuation of what I was already learning at Heritage. This is our 16th consecutive year as American Heritage parents. I wouldn't change one day. With that passion, it's going to be created a great human being, which is at the end of the day what we all want as parents and what we want as educators, to create these great human beings who are going to change the world. Uh, in, in American Heritage, dreaming big is a reality. I think if I wasn't offered so many opportunities here every year, I'd be a very, very different person, and I'd be a very different person had I not met all the teachers and students who make this place what it is. As much as it's work, I'm doing it with my best friends. I'm doing something that I love with people that I love on a daily basis. No, I really can't honestly imagine myself at any other school. I've been going here for so long that it's really become my second home. At American Heritage, we believe it's important to have a school where students and families feel a part of a community. All of our staff have their children here, and we're excited to have alumni on staff as teachers and administrators. We welcome you and your family to become a part of the American Heritage family. My vision was to have a school with plenty of room for growth. I think it's wonderful that I've had the opportunity to impact so many lives in a positive way and I've had so much wonderful help. And I every year say, how did I get so lucky to be at a school like this? Because it is amazing.